So hey guys, what's up? Mark Meese here, MeeseDesign.com. Um, a little, just for fun tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to take um, audio from YouTube and put it to, um, to save the audio from YouTube or from anything on your browser actually um, and save it to your computer. Uh, you can use this um, on any browser or technically any program you want to save the audio from. Um, if you notice right here, I have um, Audio Hijack Pro. Um, I'll leave the link to download this uh, on the on the blog. If a PC, you know, if a PC person wants to get involved with this, I'll post a video to a working tutorial how to do the same exact thing with PC. And I know Vista seems to be a problem with this. I know a few people didn't know how to do it on Vista, so hopefully I can find something for you guys to help you out. But um, yeah, first off, you get the program, double click extracts it you run it um, make sure for now you shut off Firefox and that will cut off my music then uh, bypass this licensing stuff now if you want to record something larger for say let's say a lecture or um, or even you know something of a, a larger audio limit the uh, time I guess a larger time limit um, you, you're going to have to purchase the full version or obtain the full version in one way or another. But um, for songs, this is great because you can just record and they're saved on your computer. No static whatsoever. It's when you go over a certain time limit. I, I think it's like 10 minutes. It cues in this staticky audio overlay thing. So for now, just stick to audio tracks. But if you want something bigger, you got to purchase the whole thing. Sorry. Um, so yeah, what we're going to do is you click hijack. You click record now it's recording the audio from Firefox notice I selected the application Firefox then uh, go to let's say for now we're gonna take from Pandora once this loads and starts playing it's automatically gonna take the audio from Firefox so you're not gonna have to worry about anything from there you're just gonna have to wait for the audio to play through obviously and don't run any other audio over it or it'll overlay and that's lame. You don't want two tracks going at the same time. So yeah, you can hear the music. And good. Stop the recording. Now by default, it's going to save right here to this music audio hijack folder. Um, we can go to that right now. So go to your music, audio hijack. See, I use this program all the time. Right there at the top, you're going to have that audio saved. Just to show you, I'll drag it to my desktop. And it'll play. So yeah, I mean, you can see right there the, uh, the potency of such a tool. Um, there's a lot of music out uh, on YouTube that doesn't really get a... Um, any sort of play on CDs for a while and most of the time like for hip hop and R&B stuff it's mixtape stuff anyway and it's free this is a way for you to get a hold of it without trying to look for a download all the time um, so it's perfectly legal stuff uh, if you use it the correct way so yeah I hope that helps you guys out and like I said the the Vista people the PC people I'll be sure to put something up to help you guys out too because I know from a friend of mine he said it was a uh, it was a problem to get um, audio from the from the web so I'll try to find something that'll benefit you guys as well so yeah just a little quickie for you guys and uh, I hope it helps you out and you know you can get some good audio from YouTube peace